Alright, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the Path of Rage. And today for our modded MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries playthrough, we finally get the Heavy Chain Cannon on use, and you will get to witness the glory of its destructive abilities in this episode. I hope you enjoy it. Let's jump right in. Here we are, folks. Picking right back up where we left off with the last video. Uh, we got some transmissions. Oh, okay. Guess where we're going. We're going to go for bow and arrow. Absolutely. That's just, it's too good of a mech not to. And I'm pretty certain it's not very far away. Oh, actually it is. So... We're going to continue on with our plan from last time. Got a high reward. Oh! This is a pilot. This is where we're going next. So first... We're going to repair. We're going to get Kelpie. We're also going to continue on to get Chainsaw. And then we'll head down south to get Bow and Arrow and pick up the... Um, Agincourt, the archer. All of them. Equipment check. Oh, for equipment. Right cam. Do we have the ammo we need? No. <laughs> Damn. Flesh at machine gun. No. Okay. Long time. Already seen it. Uh. We'll do our repairs. Fighter is ready to be sold. Take this dude out of cold storage, actually. Go. I could put more lasers on him if I wanted. If I put structure on him. I don't want to do it on a 45 ton mech, though. I don't really want to do it to be honest, on the Centurion. But, we'll repair him. Let's get the repairs started on this guy. Like we were thinking of doing last episode. Hundred and twenty days just to repair it. Max armor. It's still only a forty ton mech, that's the thing that sucks. But I can make this an absolutely decent um missile boat instead of the Centurion. I think that may be the way. Next armor already. It's got this already. Oh. I wish I had more clan stuff to put on it, but let's do this. Oh. One again. Oh, it's too much. Oh, shit. Just LRM fives. Hmm. 
I want to put the AMS on this guy. Just basic AMS, I think. Like so. I still have four tons to play with. My cooling is excess, uh, in excess, actually. Hmm. I wish I had two of these. How about we do it that way? I don't have ammo yet. Problem. No, this is not going to work. Not the way I want to. Revert. Ah, they're all. Don't want the jump. So we've got an extended range long laser on it. I wish I had another one. Take that off. What? Two extended mediums. Two LRM tens. One bin of ammo each. I'm missing a heat sink, really? Next armor. Takes the legs down a lot. Let's bring them up to. Th Twenty-nine is the way. I'm not worried about the arms, they're just there to protect. There we go. 133 days. Another LRM boat. <laughs> oh. We don't have anything else to build, do we? Okay. Then up. Oops. Okay. Let's go to Tripoli and just check for uh, chain cannon ammo. <gasps> we got one. We got one, folks. Oh, baby, it's on. Where do I put it though? I don't want it on any of these mechs. <laughs> okay. As soon as we get something that I can put it in the torso, not on an arm, then we're going to use it. We're going to get that chain cannon going. But that means we don't have to stop everywhere on the way. Let's take. Oh, that's too many. I might as well cancel that contract out actually. Let us go to the high reward quest here for Kelpie. Get ourselves all tier six, uh, uh, level 60 pilots. <clears throat> Kelsey, Kelpie, I believe, also comes with a mech. I know that Chainsaw does. She comes with a Vindicator, I believe. Snowshoe comes with a Shadowhawk. He comes with a Blackjack. Here we go. Does he just join us? Ah, okay. <laughs> there we go. 
Let's go here first and get the cantina mission. And I will not be putting the chain cannon ammo on the uh, blackjack either. <laughs> maybe, maybe. We'll see. Cantina killed Jenners. We see more of them than anything. Okay, uh, let's check and see. Okay. Go. First mission. Against Davion. Extreme weather warning is in effect, Commander. You'll have limited visibility out there and have to contend with sensor malfunctions. Time soon, so. We will just continue. Use the same mechs. Actually, I'm going to take. A suburban mech, I think. And give him the Centurion. He's got the best stats for missiles. There we go. I wonder how good that Griffin will be. I'm not sold on them. Our I find their hit or miss. Gigantic area map. You will have to recon the precise objectives on site. This area is heavily guarded, so watch out for hostile reinforcements. All right. You can already hear VTOLs. There it is. Firestorm here. Took him down, sir. Giant fortress in the middle of the map. Target neutralized. Oh, well, that was terrible. Target destroyed. Just walk through that. You can't actually just walk through turrets. Target acquired. Target destroyed. Moving on land target. Oh, I hate these things. They take forever to destroy. No, I don't want to guess. Target destroyed. Target acquired. Target destroyed. That one's dead already, okay. Was not expecting that. Nearly there, Commander. Approach the hidden object to pick it up. There's a hidden object, where? I will let them continue attacking while I pick this up. Always. That's close enough. Ready to start pickup operation. Cars all acquired. I do notice that the bad weather, the rain and whatnot, is not as bad on my system as it used to be. These things are such a pain in the ass. This is a massive map. Thing we definitely got to keep an eye out for when it comes to uh, urban mechs is the urban mech DF or the DFA because it has the direct fire arrow. 
when we get that, man, then things get real fun. By the way, guys, if you do like uh, my videos or whatnot, make sure to hit that subscribe button. I want to uh, see if I can hit 200 followers. If I do, then I'm probably going to get uh, my channel logo tattooed somewhere. <laughs> Most notably by the guy that designed my tattoo or channel logo, Dan Woods. He's gotten into tattooing as well, so. Die, wasp. Yeah. Oh, there we are. More stuff. Research just one. Uh oh, Igor. Ah. Go. Oh, oh, another one. Nice. We got it. Oh, more you guys coming in. Look at this. Hello. Oh, too far away. Come on, those weren't headshots. Nice. Target destroyed. Well, at least now we know for certain that the AI will use melee weapons. Sometimes they don't seem to. Or when we put an AI in a melee uh, mech, they don't try to get into melee. It does change though with the better pilots. Let me know in the comments, by the way, folks, any of you guys that also play this game modded, um, I have not in reinstalled the TT Rules uh, AI mod in a long time. I'm genuinely curious if any of you have used it, if it's better now. I found that it didn't do me a whole lot of good. Still ended up in, in resulting in very weird behavior with the AI. aren't bad. I'd take a crab. They're, they're good early game mech, and we are definitely still in the early game. Target 
See, he should be walking up to smack that thing with his mace. Is he gonna, though? I thought he lost both arms. What the? What overheated me there? That's a plane. He's all with an AC-5? Jeez. We'll go. Focusing fire. Tango down. If you find the acquisition, just walk up to it in order to pick it up. Every time, man, we lose an arm on that Phoenix Hawk. Package acquired. Boom. And SRM4 streak. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not a big fan of SRM streaks. I think I do want to take the parts for a quick draw. We can get up to a a 60 ton mech. Yeah, that'll be a that'll actually be a huge help to us. Uh, take another AC5, I guess, or a wasp part. More money. Ooh, cords and an upgrade point. There we go. So this is all easily achieved stuff. Pair. Keep losing large lasers on this guy. I think I want to. Pardon. I think I want to do it that way. Easier. Oh, right. Ninety-two days. Oh my God. Okay. I guess I won't be using him. <laughs> All right. Let's go to the next one. It'll be a good day today if we can get a new pilot and a new mech. Ooh, resource opportunity. Maybe we'll get two mechs. Okay, it's a resource mission. Difficulty 99. We will not be doing that. We can't even come close to that. Okay, so. All the salvage we can get. Because of the heavy weather, your visibility will be compromised on this mission, Commander. Stay frosty. Come out. I'm going to use the Centurion again. Goblin's good with lasers. But he's also better with... Give him the Hunchback. This guy takes the Urban Mech. Jenner? Or the Clint? I think the Clint... We need another AC-5. 
We're a hundred tons under. Think we can do it, folks? <laughs> this could be bad. But if we can pull this off, we get a new uh, level 60 pilot We've been hired to or max level supplies. 60 and uh, a new mech. Maybe I should put the, the heavy chain cannon on the Centurion. I just don't want to. I don't want it on the arm. This is Firestorm. My but we might have to. As soon as I started firing missiles, that dude focused me. Yeah, I think maybe we will have to put the chain cannon on this guy. And I will be the only one who can use him. I don't... I don't trust the chain cannon with the, the NPCs. I just don't. Not until we have more of them. <laughs> and this will be a... As long as we have it, it'll be a gun we keep moving forward to better mechs. The chain cannon is absolutely a game changer of a weapon. DC 20 ah, burst fire. Tier 4 though, I'll take it. Here. is on our list of targets. Let's make our quarter. Let's take that tank apart. Target down. Oh, damn it. Oh, it didn't connect. Neutralized. Moving on land target. Well, there's a tank right here. And I hear a big lad. Igor. Yep. Kill this dude. Go. Bloody hell, this Manticore is ripping us a new one. Oh. Something's got AMS this thing. Coordinating our attack. Acquired. Oh, you gotta die. This is firestorm. Oh, okay, die. yeah, I'm gonna have to do it. Target that, sir. Once we get firestorm. Kelpie here. Reporting vehicle destroyed. And we get um, a bit more money and what have you. We are putting the chain cannon on this gun. I have to do it. Or on this mech, on this gun. That's the way we gotta go, so onward! Right on cue. VTOL on approach. Focusing our fire on target. Guess why they call me Firestorm. No. This is Firestorm. Enemy mech destroyed. I don't wanna guess anything. Or on me, guys. Threat removed. Hmm? Okay. Oh, are they all those? OK, 
Okay, no, they're not. Radio towers, fuel silos, shit like that. Target acquired. Target destroyed. Okay, so far so good. Oh shit, a Zeus! Not good. Not good. Order acknowledged. Doing good. Tango down. Get him. Get this dude. Where is the? There it is. Target acquired. Share target identified. Firestorm here. Tank right Enemy here. We gotta take destroyed. care of. Let's get in here and do some damage. Radio tower, fuel silos, satellite uplinks. Radio tower. Right here. Punch it. Oh, the last two things we recovered salvage from was just money. No actual, like, parts. That's weird. Boom. Alright, we're out of here. We are inbound on marked evac point. Get here as quickly as you can, Commander. Pretty sure. Yes, the Clint still has jump jets. Here we go. I'm just gonna get them to form on me because this is scary. Group target received. Firestorm here. Reporting vehicle destroyed. Artisan tank right there, they're not shooting at. Run away! <laughs> oh, yeah, I did not have. I did not have enough to take all this on if I if I hadn't have run for it. Still, new pilot, new mech, folks. Hmm. And then we'll head from here to get another new pilot and another new mech. And then yet another new mech. And we will end up with Agincourt very soon. Ow. Uh, yeah, I'm going to... I don't know. Hmm. Okay. Those. Yeah, I don't want the Zeus parts. I'm not a fan of Zeus's either. They're not bad, they're just really wide. And you see how easy they are to take out with the core. They got a huge chest hitbox. I could take a couple more. Yeah, and I could put more lasers on this. Why not? We're still in the low tiers with our with our dudes. Another PPC. Actually, take more medium lasers. We're running short on them too. Glad to be aboard, sir. Billeted and ready. There we go. 
Auto cannon velocity. Okay, nice. Job rewards. Kill manticores. Upgrade points, which we'll check now. Two points. What do we want to go for next? I think we're going to get into this territory soon. But not quite yet. Improve the pilot cover recovery time. Here we are. Okay. Our map. Can't do that. Where was... There she is. Can I not reach there? Okay, this is weird. Alright, we're gonna go here first and do repairs. I should just be able to click on that... that planet. Next. Now. This dude's already set up. I'm gonna leave him just the way he is. This is a great mech for uh, AI to use right out of the gate. Griffin 2C is set up as best as I can get. We'll have to give it a try, but it's time, folks. It's time. Bear all. Take this out, and this, and this. Heavy chain cannon. See, the weight is next to nothing. So, that means I can put this AMS on him. I don't want it in the head. And I can also max armor. There we go. I still have three tons to work with. So, can I put a better... Um... Uh, LRM on it. Like this. And I'm still under tonnage by a lot. I don't need. Well, can I put another LRM 10 in here? I can. Oh, here we go, folks. Now we're in business. Now, max armor. Arms stay up. It just drops a little leg. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Faint mech. Fly to all. And now, folks. You will get to see the awesomeness that is the chain cannon. Uh, this guy needs to be fully repaired, too. I don't have the money for it. Okay, it can be repaired. Let's go find some trouble. Go over here. Why can't I target that? Doesn't make sense. I just realized through that build, too, that I didn't switch to the right hand side of the screen. Oh well. Uh, now, star map. Thank you! There we go! Actually, I want to see, first things first, do they have more DC ammo? No. Okay. I keep clicking the wrong one. Might as well repair the Clint, too. 
Okay. Get ourselves another pilot and another new mech, and then we have to seriously concentrate on money. I may just focus on money right now, instead of salvage. Might be in my better interests. Again, that's something I was talking about in the previous episode, maybe in the beginning of this one as well. With that upgrade system, we have to be a lot more careful with our money. So, pick a fight on a battlefield. Let's do it. Uh, I still want some salvage, just in case. Oh, and now, who is our lowest dude? Get rid of him and throw in. I see, I'm ready to drop. Help me. Gotta get rid of him next. Get rid of this. Actually, he might be best with that, that mech after all. And... Do I want to bring the, the blackjack instead? Yeah. Let's see how he does with the blackjack. I know how I'm going to do with the, the chain cannon. Unfortunately, they've addressed it so that when you do jam the weapon, it doesn't last the entire round. I think that might just be the regular chain cannon. The heavy one will actually eventually do a cooldown and you can use it again. We have friendlies under assault from hostile forces. Link up with them and hold off the enemy advance as long as possible. Be sure not to overextend yourself, Commander. All right. Eventually, you will need to fall back to the evac point. This may be a much better mech here, folks. There they are. What do we got here? Blackjack and a decent hunchy. I'd take that hunch back any day. Ah. The volumetric fog is awesome. I feel like it's, I can still see through it, you know? Vaughn, and you did a nice job on this, Vaughn, if you're watching it. mean like that? <laughs> I love the chain cannon. It makes me happy. Yeah, let me know in the comments what you guys think of the idea of uh, getting a tattoo of the, the channel logo when I hit 200 subscribers. One thing I do know that I have to do more of, as much as I complain about having to do it, is shorts. It is unfortunately the reality. If you don't make shorts, YouTube just doesn't like to recommend you. This is not the best mech for here. Moving to range. Tango eliminated. Invalid target. Yeah, invalid target, because I lost radar lock two seconds before I hit it. Oh, the shredding is real! God, I love the heavy chain cannon! <laughs> that matches the class of VTOL we're after. Yes, it does. It's gonna die, though. Right now. Target destroyed. 
Yeah, this, this, the volumetric fog one actually seems to be a lot easier on my, my video card. I'm not getting as much hitching as I used to. Direct. Where are you? Direct. When we see heavy mechs, I'll start like cutting their legs out from underneath them. They won't know what hit them. And it's got range. The same length as uh, the LRMs. I mean, I mean, come on. <laughs> and we're under a dome, I just realized that. Heading along a trajectory that intersects with your position. Four more enemies, here we go. I should be switching this over to um, night vision, like heat vision, but I mean, you gotta admit, it looks cool just like this. All the lighting. Oh, hello. Goodbye. I mean, for God's sake, it's just... <laughs> it's so OP. It's so OP. But now you guys know, like, there's no denying it. Uh, when I first was able to salvage this, why I freaked out so much, because this... Right. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. <laughs> Come on, give me some good salvage. What do we got? Well, all right. Oh, I was going to say we could finish off. I like the Cantero. Kintaro better. We've got four parts of one. I'll take it. I'll take that. Yep. Bingo. There we go. And he did actually decent damage. I mean, come on. Oops. In any case, folks, that was an epic way end the episode i hope you enjoyed that i hope you enjoyed seeing what the uh, heavy chain cannon is capable of this the destruction it just unleashes on everything in your path if you did give me a thumbs up if you thought it's too op and, and you want me to take it out which i'm not gonna do give me a thumbs down let me know your thoughts in the comments overall subscribe if you're new to help me reach that 200 uh subscriptions goal and until next time i've been ray j games bye bye